All right, here we go. Okay, so we just finished doing that one, uh, which is this one where the ball just perpetuates back and forth, perpetual, forever, forever, and ever, and ever. Okay, ballion back, here I am, okay. So, okay, so if you can do this, that's kind of cool, right? Now, if I said to you, um, I'm gonna give you 120 frames, or even 100 frames, doesn't matter. Let's go in here, change it to 100, okay. Clearly, I've drawn something here from another layer, side to side. Uh, we'll make a new layer here. We we'll call this the ball. Ball anim. Okay, I've done so many. Oh, better save, Balian. What is going on here? Okay, here we go. File save as, save scene as, give it a new number, whatever, and then we'll call it bootcamp demo number two. I did that one, and it's ball. And then I'm going to save it again, and I'm going to call this to a ball perpetual whatever okay so I know what I'm doing okay all right so what what if what if you had 100 frames okay and you're working in two frames here okay I mean that's two panels I mean and you said to yourself Mr. Ballion I want to have multiple balances and I don't want to have a um, to be perpetual so just uh, over time gravity is going to pull this down even further and we're going to have less of a bounce back up okay so basically you're saying to me let's get rid of this layer new layer my lovely blue here pencils on okay so basically you're saying this here oops do I not there's a new layer and there's my floor there's my ball love it there it is and it comes straight down hits right there okay so what happens is now here's a question for you guys midpoint do you think this ball comes back up this high without knowing what it is okay and do you think the next bounce goes halfway again and so on and so on and so on okay so you decide what this is and then there's a hint magic word reference 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 so what we're gonna do we're gonna watch reference we're gonna count frames and we're gonna find out that there's two theories I'm gonna throw at you if the ball drops from here first time it's here do we lose 50 percent roughly or let's say we lose only 25 percent or is it something else because that will determine your decrease uh, uh, each time loss of energy basically right I told you guys that if this ball was going forward in, in time and space forward in space and time okay thank you okay there it is if I start here and I go boom 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 all the way down here I said to you guys whatever this is your proportions you'll figure it out but the key is this right here that gradual arc here okay so you can go boom like this and if you keep doing that it'll look relatively realistic okay so th that's if it's going forward but if it's staying in in one spot and it just goes ding, ding down down and whatever and so on and so on that's something we will figure out by research and study okay I'll leave that for now so without bringing uh, this parts done thank you my previous second recording is done so this is the third recording here so imagine now okay so I have even 12 down, 12, sorry, 12 down, 12 up. I'm really rushing here, okay? So uh, let's say 10 down, 10 up, whatever, okay? 24, 34, let me just press S here. Uh, 10 over, S. 34, 44, S. Now, do you think anything changed here? If your answer is no, because nothing changed, look, up and down nothing happened here so right now I'm changing it from perpetual to natural uh, sorry eventual decrease okay so start it up here and what I showed you yesterday was that uh, let's go to show uh, where's grease pencil here boom let's see show grease pencil good okay so what I could do come over here get my grease pencil Ooh, pencil yellow that's kind of cool so the highest point is here okay here's my ground okay it hit here so you see it hit the ground and it went back up alright so here if I want I can click on new key and I'll say Mr. Bellion your previous key was there 
right? Why isn't it showing me anything here? Let's go down here. Good. I can have a bit of uh, onion skinning going on here. So what I'll just do is just color over it. This is the ground. And then when it comes up, I want this guy to go somewhere here, just for now. Okay. So, and then I uh, go down, I go up again. Let's go down a little one third more. Okay. Let's just do that each time. Okay. So the last one was here and above that was somewhere there. Who knows? Okay, if this is confusing you, I'm sorry. I'll explain things in a second. Okay, I'm going to get rid of this guy here, and I'm going to go back to the Move tool. Okay, you'll see here. Up, hit, go back up. Okay, right here, highest point. But we're saying come a little lower. Okay, somewhere. This is really huge. Okay, okay so let's just say something like that. This is the midpoint right there. Okay, so from here, so we lost some, right? Hit. Oh, I haven't done anything. Look. See? So I know right now, if you want this ball here to come to the ground, I need to change this to 1. Because 1 is ground. Okay, cool. So I'm going to go back up after this to where? Too high. Too high. So what we want to do is drop it each time. Okay? So now watch the difference here. Okay? Alright, a couple things happen here. Okay? You notice and I'm noticing too. Why is this doing that? There's something about the playback. Okay, don't worry about it. But I'm going to show you something really cool. And this is just gets confusing. I apologize. Look, guys, I only did animations. I only worked on the Y axis. Okay, so I'm just going to click on Y and I'm going to press F for frame. Oh, look at this. Sharp and soft. Oh boy. Okay, so cool. So let's see if we can fix that, right? All right, while I fix that, let me just zoom out here so you can go middle scroll in and out. Notice what's going on, guys. Look, sharp out, hangs, and then soft in, soft. Like, you know, you can see it gradual, speeds up, slows down, slows up, speeds up, and right up to here somewhere. Okay, let me just crank this up higher now. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go to the frame right here at 44, and I'm just going to bring this up. Oh, boy, here we go. Like just so, I just want a gradual um, de decrease, okay, decline of energy. All right, so first thing first, like before, break the elbow. Select, middle scroll, up. So let's make this a nice sharp contact. Here too. Okay, and watch the difference now. Okay, let's press play. And that's my ground here, so it's good enough. Watch the difference. See? Okay, nothing else happened there. Cool. Escape or press stop. All right, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to get rid of grease pencil because it's probably confusing you. So basically, roughly what we're doing is we're just going, uh, we're losing energy and we're in over time too. We haven't watched any references. We're just saying it's not going to take the same amount of time to go up uh, and it's going to take less time to come down because we know that. Okay, so let's just uh, go from 10 to 8. Okay, so I'm going to go to 52. I'm just going to press S and another 8 or maybe even 7. 8 up, 7 down, maybe. Let's just keep it even for now, and then you guys can fix it afterwards. S, once you uh, start um, looking at your reference. So look. So here, I know that this needs to go to the ground, right? So what do I do? Just press 1. And I know that here should be sharp. Oh, okay. Boom. Break the elbows. Bring it nice and sharp so we have impact points, right? And this is giving us hang time up here, which is kind of nice. So watch this now. Let's press play. Boom 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 okay obviously now look what happened here this is kind of weird look it went to the same point so that can't be good right so I can either change it here or change it in the viewport so you guys most of you will jump here I can play in here myself just going like that holding shift and bringing it down a touch okay so you'll see now look how cool that is boom 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 okay all right, how am I doing? All right, nine, another another 12, uh, 12 minute tut tutorial. Okay, so this was something like eight. Let's go with six. This is all even stuff, okay? It's scary. So 66, S, 72, S, boom. And we know the midpoint here needs to be on the ground. No problem. Press one, done. Oops, wrong one, Balian. You had the right idea, but I was in the wrong place, right? Okay, no problem. So let's go here. I love making mistakes. Press one done okay and this guy here 
right here needs to go up a bit, right? And it's going to be, like I said, less than that by one third or half. It's up to you. You've got to play around, play around, and, and get a theory for what you want. Okay? And here we go. Break and highlight, marquee, and up, boom, up, give it some hang time, and so on. So in 100 frames, this is what I have. It's not, I'm not fully, uh, it's not fully done here, but you're noticing. Okay, pretty nice. One, two, three, and then four. Something happened, a rush there. No worries, whatever. That's the idea. Okay, this will only make sense if we watch um, any frames of reference. Where is my site? Okay, let's go to Balian here. Playlist. Somewhere in here, I have animation reference. Where is it? Where is it? What do we got here? May animation class and master class. Gesture animation reference. Look at that. I have two of them. Okay, go with the 14. One with more. Okay. Nice. There's so many different ones. So this one is going forward in time. And this one here is cool. Stationary. Look. Boom. Right there. That might be a good one. Just to get a sense of, you know. So here, uh, let's see. What do I do after that? Do I do it again? Yeah. Uh, thank you for that. Bye-bye. Here we go. Press play. Drop. Thank you. Drop it. <laughs> Two, three, four, five. That kind of thing. Okay. So what you would do, and believe it or not, oh boy, did this happen again? Watch this. In I think in the most recent YouTube, let's see, somewhere here. Could I press uh, stop and comma? Yeah, frame by frame. Look out, people. Look. Let's see. Here we go. He's going to drop it at some point. That would be me. Here we go. Waiting. I'm just pressing uh, period, 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 period. Okay, come on. Okay, let me just slide over here and just find it. Okay, Balian, come on. It's almost like an anticipation. I went up before down. It's kind of cool. Okay, here we go. Okay, so check this out. Ready? This is what you want to do. You want to find that spot before I release it. Ready? And then press period. One. Here we go. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Okay, so that's 13 down. Write that down. 13 down. And then we go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, so it went 13 down, 12 up. Okay, so you write that down. And then you get a sense of, oh yeah, Balian said something about, okay, so you go 13 down. Here, right up to there and then you go 12 up okay and then let's watch the next one so we kind of get a sense of what's going on here okay this is a way of measurement so back here I'm gonna press period again one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven cool eleven down one two three four five six seven eight nine ten yes so eleven down ten up okay Got it. Okay, people, this is what you're going to do. You're going to start going. So from here, it was whatever, and then 11. So you go 11 down, and then 10 up, that kind of thing. You'll get these changes. And you notice it's one. It's kind of interesting, right? And then you just, you, you have to basically study your reference and do your best, okay? I'm going to stop here because that kind of makes sense and I hit my mark I want to keep these short and sweet for you guys okay and basically this is it right so the first one was what there let me check again sorry let me fix this 13 12 11 10 okay 13 12 11 10 so I'll just go left boom right here 13 and a 12 is 25 boom right here 25 and then 11 uh, would be 36 so we'll go boom 36 and then we go uh, 10 to 46 so left click over. Do you get what I mean? So here's the beginning. Watch it. And then what you do is you come back here and you fix these curves, right? Come back and you go, okay, that looks kind of a nice curve. Yeah, there's a nice hang time here and so on and so on. Okay, can you fix this up here? So you want a bit of hang. So, and I'll, I'll let you guys continue from here. Boom boom that kind of thing and maybe we'll go to 120 frames it doesn't matter and but that's it okay this is a learning experience enjoy it use your reference by just doing this you just learn how to do this part without squash and stretch and it's not moving in the x direction forward that's next okay let's shut this down bellion out bye bye